school bus full of children, the target of a road rage attack in New Jersey. Tonight, police are trying to track down a driver who went on a profanity laced tirade and even punched out the window of the school bus. The bus driver talked to Eyewitness News reporter Lucy Yang about the frightening incident. It was 2.45 in the afternoon. The last handful of youngsters, only five to eight years old, were about to be dropped off at home when their bus got caught in a road rage incident. What? Slow down. What you cannot see in this video is the bus driver's window being shattered by someone's fist. That was back on April 16th in Howell Township, New Jersey. Kathy Anderson, a bus driver for 32 years, said she was trying to make a left onto Ramtown Greenville Road from Moses Milch Drive. You can see there's an S turn with blind spots on her left. When she thought it was clear, she pulled out. As I did that, a car was coming up the road and the driver locked up the brakes, so the car kind of fishtailed a little bit. It went downhill from there. She says the passenger in the other vehicle immediately resorted to obscenities and violence. And he punched that window with force. And it kind of caught me off guard, you know, because I didn't expect it. And I got choked up a little bit. I got a little scared, so the kids on the bus got scared. Kathy says the driver and the passenger in the other vehicle were young, probably only teenagers. Certainly not a great start to being responsible and courteous on the road. Police were called. Eventually, another bus took the frightened Greenville school students home. He was a bad man. That's what they kept saying. He was a mean. He was mean. They were a little crying, and they were, they were apologetic to me. They started writing me little letters. <laughs> These are some of the sweet cards they made for Kathy the next day. Police now looking for the aggressive passenger. Would like, you know, an apology, at least for the children that were on the bus that he's scared, and to me. In Howell Township, New Jersey, Lucy Yang, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.